Thank you for taking the time to view our property tour at Bayshore Windmill Village. Today we find ourselves at lot G6, the back of a very quiet cul-de-sac here at this gated community. Bayshore Windmill Village is a 55 and older park here in the heart of Bradenton, where we stand. We're about 15 minutes away from the Gulf of Mexico. I got shopping and dining within walking distance, as well as medical facilities, all within an easy stroll from the front of the park. Lot rent is comparable to the park, or to the uh, to the county lot rent average, rather. Uh, we do have a gorgeous swing pool and a ton of social activities and amenities here. This two bedroom, two bathroom mobile home just came on the market today. It does need to be sold as soon as possible. Uh, the seller does need, just need to uh, get rid of it and move on to the uh, next stage of their life. So if you're looking for a deal in a gorgeous gated community with great amenities and a great location close to beaches, make sure you stick around for the whole video here. This is Mark with the Mobile Home Dealer, and we really, we really appreciate you being a part of this tour at Lot G6. So with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into it. As we come up to the carport, you'll see it's a, a taller carport there. So if you have a big pickup truck or a trailer, you got plenty of space. Definitely large enough for two cars. There is some light TLC that needs to be done on this home, but the price reflects it accordingly. So please keep that in mind as you watch the tour. One of the rare features of this home is we have two storage sheds. Usually only see one. First one up here, obviously you got the trash cans, so it's a storage area, but we do have a newer full-size water heater there and functional washer and dryer, uh, as well as the utility tub in the middle. So that's the first one. We also have a second one here, which is really kind of neat. We've only seen a couple of these on the channel. So this is gonna be great with the cabinetry. Uh, it puts your um, beach gear, your fishing gear, whatever you'd like to do it. And I'd also like to point out, we do have power. The camera will pull that up. We do have power in here. Uh, so all you uh, handy professionals, if you wanted a place to, uh, to tinker on some uh, projects, you have plenty of space. Central AC unit was just serviced recently. It's blow blowing nice cool air throughout the entire home. Vinyl siding has been updated. We'll take a look at that here on the side of the home. The vinyl siding has been done on the entire house. It's all in great condition. Skirting's in good shape with the stone. Uh, if you see it in the camera, they also put in the chicken wire there behind there. Uh, so all the critters stay out, which is very nice. A huge screen in a Florida room, which we'll take a look at here in a moment, but it really just opens up the house. Separate entrance there to the Florida room. Another, another shot of the uh, end of the cul-de-sac there. Now, as we enter into the body of the home, main area, I have two short steps. We're gonna be jumping right into the, um, right into the kitchen. All the appliances are functioning and they are staying with the home. I have a vinyl type of floor here, all in good, uh, good shape, no soft spots to be spoken of. Solid cabinets, or solid countertops rather, solid cabinets. Deep sink and plenty of light to light up this area. Does have a separate dining area here. So what you see is what you get. Now I'm gonna point out some of the things in the house that may need to be uh, attended to like I do with all the videos. We do have some staining on the carpet. <clears throat> not sure if that is permanent or if it can be taken out with a, with a rug clean, not sure. Just wanna bring that to your attention. Very large living area. Now, another thing I wanna to bring to your attention. There was at one time a roof leak uh, that has now been patched and there's no issues with it whatsoever, according to the seller. Here's a Florida room that we saw out there earlier. Separate entrance, plenty of power, and the uh, the windows in here in the video, they're actually glass. They're not gonna be, they're not gonna be vinyl. 
so they're in great shape. Short hallway leads us to our first full bath. We have a raised vanity, tub shower combo, and a toilet there in the corner. First bedroom here in the hallway, quite large. Looks like we have a queen bed, and you'll see just plenty of space on either side of the bed with the large uh, closet there. Master bedroom in great shape. Again, the furniture is going to stay. Nice cabinets there. And the carpet continues. Now, of course, you're going to start to see a couple more issues with the carpet there in the video. But the um, enclave here is very nice. You don't see a lot of these. So you have a closet here, <clears throat> excuse me, the closet there. Nice area for a work, uh, work area, home desk, a ladies makeup counter, you name it. In the second bathroom, the newer toilet in the corner. Taller uh, vanity there. And then we got the showers, shower stall behind the door. It's a very good size home here. <coughs> Excuse me. Very good size home at lot um, G6 here in Bradenton. Uh, very motivated seller here who wants to uh, get the home sold very quickly for the new owners. So they can immediately start beginning their Florida dream here as we, uh, as we head out to that palm tree lined street. If you or someone that you know is interested in a property like this, a very nicely kept two bed, two bath, needs a little bit of updating, but uh, overall the bones are in great shape. Please give us a call as we expect this one to sell fast. If you haven't uh, yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. We uh, enjoy the comments on all the videos and we do the best we can to get back to them as soon as possible to give the most updated information about all of our properties. This is Mark with the Mobile Home Dealer. Thank you so much for coming on the tour of Lot G6. Folks, we'll see you all in the next one.